that's like refreshing. Like on a, on a, on a hot summer day. Wait, I can't even, look, it's like enough to like, woo! Oh, wait, 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 wait. This is like weird hand exercise. Okay. What? When you turn it on, like, try and go the other way. It's, it's like, whoa, it's like, <laughs> do it. Like, whoa. <laughs> oh, listen to that. It sounds like the battery's dying already. Oh, it is? I'm really stupid. I'm like, wait, let's squander the powerful <laughs> battery. Wait, 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 see, but your face. What? I, I look like I'm just talking to nothing right now. <laughs> get in frame. What's get that? Get in frame. Get in frame. Okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start at the beginning. Okay. Are you ready? Hey, everybody, it's Bunny, and I'm here today with... <laughs> you big oh, you... brother? <laughs> Today, we are doing everybody's favorite day of the week. The day of the week when we ask ourselves, pass me that box. Does this thing really work? And today, I already ripped open the box. Woo! Because I got the party started a little bit early. I thought we were gonna have to like unscrew this thing, but we didn't. It was already loaded with the... Oh, come on. No! Why am I such an idiot? I am so dumb for real. Uh, so today we are going to be testing out this year's Wubble Bubble Ball. You know that generally we get one every single summer. Last summer we got Wubble X. The year before that we got Tiny Wubble. And the year before that we got the original Wubbly Bubbly Ball. So if you guys had the original Wubble, which has still been one of my favorites as seen on TV things we have ever tried, a lot of you guys were complaining when you go Got your wubble bubble that you were taking it outside and you were basically doing what they showed in the infomercial honestly which was people jumping on it kicking it bouncing it throwing it outside and a lot of people were complaining that theirs had broken so now there's like a squirrel i swear it's like every video i film now there's a squirrel somewhere in the world to I distract like, me just sees the lights and like, oh. <laughs> what's going on now they have come out with the super blah, 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 uh, which basically you are supposed to be able to squish it step on it throw it outside maybe have a small animal bite it with its teeth slam it I don't, what, what are you, what are you, I, I don't know. People, <laughs> people play so roughly with their tongues. I'm always scared I'm gonna break something, so I'm always like, oh, okay, I'm, <laughs> I'm playing with it. Today, we're gonna do some extreme stuff with the super wubble bubble ball. We are gonna try and sit on it, we're gonna try and toss it, and I'm gonna try and run into it, slash over it maybe, with my car. So it's gonna get wild. It's gonna oh, yeah. get wild boy, and I'm, I'm gonna a little bit of Hulk smash. You're gonna do a Hulk, Hulk smash. 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 So we're gonna try and like I don't know. We're gonna try and sit on it. First of all, we're gonna try and inflate it, and uh, uh, there should be a nozzle. Oh look, I found the nozzle. I cannot. But it's still not turning on. No. I just wanna like the, the, I don't think it put this into last, my like, nose. Can I inflate my head? <laughs> you guys we can't find batteries or a screwdriver in this house but we did find another sort of inflating uh thing that we have for inflatable mattresses yay we yeah. improvise so i went ahead and like uh stuck the inflator cone in what do you call this funnel nozzle yep. yeah it's like a knob funnel yeah let's like, see if this is gonna work it doesn't like exactly <gasps> I'm six foot. It's so. three footy ish enough. Yeah. Oh, look, look. Our Wubble has an Audi. It doesn't have an any belly button. Look at my little peddler tail. Oh, look. I, I changed it to an any. Look at the Wubble. Look at the Wubble. <laughs> okay, the slap test, it proved worthy. We're going to see you outside. Okay. It's going down. I'm wide open, coach. <laughs> Oh, oh, sorry. Too high. Overshot. La 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 I'm like hitting myself in the face. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Let's like, let's high five with it. Yes! <laughs> Worst ever. Okay, I'm gonna bounce it to you. Ah! <laughs> All right. <laughs> Wait, okay, okay, up close, up close. I know there's like no protection of like not. This is a good way for me to hit. <laughs> okay, wait, 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 here we go. Here we go. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm like, oh, I'm like the right into the chest. So it's like, oh. This thing has no, it just gives. Uh, okay. 
Okay, wait, I'm gonna try and get a city pose. I'm gonna sit on it. Like, All right, here we go. Like a city kitty. Sit wait. test. Can we see, there we go, there we go, okay. Sit test phase This is gonna one. hurt my butt. Oh, ow! Yep. Oh. Straight to the concrete. Wait, wait, Straight I'm to really... the concrete. <laughs> wait, look, 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 it's like a, there you it's go. like a... <laughs> I gotta get you on. There you go. And, and Wait, there oh, we look, go. It's like, a, it's like the world's most least comfortable beanbag chair. There you go. But well, look at it. It's like fully smashed into the ground. Just center yourself. <laughs> there Wait, you go. why did I think that? Oh. <laughs> I just, I just rolled like a dead fish into the ground. Okay. You guys, unique test. I've got on my Hellraisers today, my all-time favorite life shoes, and they're covered in spikes. Shoes not to Woo! be ready. You try to bounce it onto my foot. Right, here we go. Okay. Uno, dos, tres. Ooh. Hey, it survived. Can we get a kick shot? A kick shot. Can we get a? Look at that. It's surviving my spiky, super spiky shoes, which will cut into my skin if I'm clumsy enough with them. Wind caught up a little bit. Yeah, the wind. Yeah. Look at that, now the audio is gonna be terrible. <laughs> it's gonna be like. All right, okay. ready? Oh! <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> well, it looks like fast I grabs. I swear that was fingernail. Look at that. Hey, you guys! Oh man! Well, it can withstand the shoes of death, but wait. But what if I punctured a hole into it with the shoe of death? I wonder if I tore a tiny hole. You might have. I've never broken one of these before. It could have weakened the. Dude, I feel extreme guilt. What is that thing? I've got to Google it again. Where you think inanimate objects are alive? Hmm. Why did I do it? Why am I so evil? <laughs> Heidi ho, neighbor. <laughs> I just got this. Well, you can use it as a nice sun hat now. Oh, we have another one. We should go blow that up. I didn't even get to do the truck thing yet. I didn't even get to hit it with a car. I feel so sad. So a fingernail took it down. Or unless my shoes punched punched a hole. Which it could have. Look, there you go. You can be a brand new horror monster. What can we call you? Bubblegum face. <laughs> Bubblegum face. <laughs> I was purposefully trying to pop this one though, but I didn't really think I'd be successful. I feel great sadness in my heart. I feel like we should get a shovel and bury it. <laughs> like a bonnet. We're gonna take you back inside and we're gonna try and inflate it again. Maybe we overinflated it just a little bit. Maybe we made it too big. Was it bigger than three foots? I don't know. I don't think so. Because it was about right up here. You know, about up to my past. We killed line. it. We killed it. Yeah, we killed, killed it. <laughs> oh, okay. It's dead. Death by fingernail. Death by fingernail. Oh, I feel like this whole video is maybe moderately banana focus. <laughs> eh. One down. One to go. <laughs> Do you hear the dogs? Dude, our neighbor dogs. What's uh what's the one from mythology? Sir Serbius. Serbius. Sever Sever the when the The three-headed dog? Yeah, the one that, that guarded guards the underworld. Hades or something. That's that's our neighbor dogs. Okay? They're like Literally, it'll be like, oh, yeah, uh, time to go to sleep. Four in the morning. Bark, 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 bark. Like, what are you barking at? What are you barking at? What's so exciting at four in the morning? Nothing. I really hope this one doesn't break because I really feel like the world's most destructive evil person. <laughs> I was always like that. If I ever broke a toy when I was a kid, I felt such horrendous guilt. It was, it was, it was a real bad time. Yeah. Okay. Your parents bought you that special toy. The last thing you wanted to do is break. It's time to go outside again and hopefully not destroy this one immediately. Bubble bubble, take two. All right. Uh, I don't have my uh, spiky shoes on now. I feel like we should just like, I don't know what test that was. <laughs> I was like, can I run around it? Can you create static electricity? Oh, I hate that. <laughs> it's like the worst. Okay, it's not the worst feeling in the world, but it is. It is. Okay, this is too, this is too much. Woo! Okay, what should we do? Should I go ahead and do the car test? Should we do the car test? I feel like that's another way we're going to instantly break it. Well, well, Look at it. It's so magical when it goes like... <laughs> Especially when you get hit straight in the face with it. <laughs> well, we hit it. We kicked it. She stepped on it with the death shoes. 
we go, here we go. Hey! Whoa! There we go. Okay, I'm gonna get a cool shot of that. I'm gonna let you bounce it, and I'm gonna get some up close bubbly action. Okay. Look at that. Da 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 da. It really does feel fun, though. Okay, make it go up high. Woo! Oh. Woo! Okay. <laughs> it still looks like maybe it gets a little of these. I don't know if you guys can see or not, but it's like a little tiny like scrape on it. And I feel like sometimes that is what eventually causes it to tear. Oh look, you're like squish, squishy squishing it. And it's still living, still living, still thriving. You're like doing push-ups on a level hey. level. You use it as an exercise ball. So I will feel like it is harder to get those scratches in it that makes it easier to break overall on the Super Wubble than the original Wubble. I will just say though that my original Wubble never broke. But we also just mainly like keep it inside. To me, I just like the effect of kind of like how it wobbles and how it does feel like a bubble. That's all I really need in life. So now we're gonna try and uh, hit it with a truck because I guess, I don't, am I trying to break this? I'm really not. I kind of don't want to break it. It's so pretty. It's like a big giant piece of bubble gum. And you do, but look, I'm putting my nails in it now. And see, it's not, it's not breaking on the nails. Oh, but look, every time I do that, look, it kind of, I do see my nail marks in it. Oh, can you guys see that? Everywhere I grabbed it with my nails, it does look like it kind of made that spot a little bit weaker. I wonder if grabbing it with my nails is what tore it. My nails on this hand are a little long and these like last two ones are a little sharp. So maybe it was in fact my nails. My nails are evil. Here we go. Bunny will be hitting me with her truck. The ultimate bubble bubble test. Are you ready? I am. Ready? Okay. <laughs> it's like, whoop! <laughs> <laughs> Hit it! Oh, hold on. Hold on. You want to run over it? Like go under it? No? I think it'll live. I think it'll live. Yeah. I think it'll live. All right, here we go. Here we roll it. Go! But look, he thinks it can just be a patch job. Look, there's a little patch. So we're gonna try and patch right it. Right here. We're gonna try and patch it and then we'll see if we can inflate it again. Hmm. There's a couple of patch jobs actually. Oh no, but we have six. <laughs> I think we have like six patches. Yeah. I feel very sad. It ran, it, it survived. Somebody else on YouTube said they ran it over and that it survived. Well, Maybe they didn't run over it with a truck doll. It did survive. Now I, I can detest this. It did survive the initial first run over. Once it hit the back, that's when it blew. You guys, we sat down to patch it and he made a very, very sad discovery. There was only like small areas that needed patching here, but then he found it did rip really largely here at the bottom. I don't think we can patch that. That's like a giant hand size gaping hole. You only can hole. patch like little Oh, and things. it's so gross and dirty. <laughs> ah! I'm freaking out. I wish I had a microphone so I could be like on the news and be like, as a witness, what did you see? Tell them all about it. But I haven't been no. able to watch the footage back yet, but I don't think we caught it actually being run over by the car <sighs> because I'm the worst YouTuber ever. You so. can see the oil stains. <laughs> <laughs> when we threw it in front of the truck, it pretty much, it hit the truck and then went underneath the first part of it. Now, what I think what happened was it couldn't survive being run over by probably your tire too. But I believe this section right here, this section actually broke, the one we can't patch up. Mm. 
caught on the tailpipe and ripped open. Mm. So Plus that's probably extremely hot also. Exactly. So it could have been a heat thing. Exactly. So that's what caused this thing, I believe, to rip. I think if you ran it over with your tire or something like that, it would just crease to the tire and pop right out like you it did for when she sat on it or when I was doing push-ups on it. It yeah. flexes with everything that you put pressure on. Yeah. Just can't get super sharp hot things, I guess. Exactly, or super sharp shoes. I mean, I kind of feel like you shouldn't be close enough, like playing close enough to a car. Yeah. That's probably uh, real bad. Probably shouldn't be playing in the street. No, it, it's- Which is what we just did. That would be like extreme wobble bubble. Yeah. yeah. We, we would need like, we yeah, we'd need extreme wobble, not super wobble. <laughs> we, need, we need the next generation. Yeah. I feel yeah. terrible. But I feel like we were kind of trying to do epic stuff with this one and kind of see how far we could push it. I definitely, like I was saying outside, I do feel like this one is stronger just for balancing it on the concrete. I feel like it is still a wobble bubble, so it's really fun. I, we should have tried to do other like easy stuff, like yeah. bounce it into trees or something. <laughs> we did a little too many extreme things. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I think if you use this one in normal play, like I know a lot of people were talking about the original wobble, that they would throw it outside and it would get stuck in a flower bush or something like that and then it would pop or they would throw it into a tree or like the dog or cat would jump at it and that that would immediately bust it i definitely do feel like this one is a lot stronger than those but i feel like if you do still run over it with a car <laughs> or maybe throw it directly against spiked shoes yes. it's probably going to pop but i think like if you're just like sitting on it or whatever like it yeah. didn't even come close to popping right no. when we were like she put her full body on it yeah and it just, just kind of was kind of like rolling yeah, around it rolls around I, mean, I was doing push-ups with it yeah put my full body on it. it it worked just fine. yeah so i feel like if you use it like with normal play that it's gonna be fine a lot of you guys have been requesting me to test this item out telling me that other people had like shut a garage door down on it uh, and then it had survived and um i think it's lucky penny shop who ran over it with a car. That's another YouTube channel that does a lot of toy stuff. They're pretty they're pretty fun to watch. But I think they ran over it with some sort of car, but I have not had time to watch those videos yet. Um, I feel so bad because I do love Wubble Bubbles. This is definitely, over the years of testing out toys and stuff, been one of my all-time favorites, and now I feel so bad that I got two brand new ones and bust them all. We destroyed them. Great! Thank you guys so, so much for watching and for hanging out. I feel like we've got lots of other Does This Thing Really Works coming out in the next couple weeks. I think we're going to be able to do them weekly again now because I have quite a few things. Um, I have them. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys so, so much for watching and for hanging out. You will see him in future videos. We have a special mystery unboxing that we might actually film later today. Thank you guys so, so much for watching and for hanging out. If you're not already and you'd like to be, I've just been looking at myself the whole time I've been talking. That's the worst. <laughs> the worst. I'm like, hey. Well, I'm new to this, so what? I just I keep looking at her on what you, camera. What so. are you doing? If you're not already and you'd like to be, hit that button down below. Subscribe. Become a member of the Swamp Family and give an alligator at swings. Also, if you want, you can like me on Facebook, facebook.com slash graveyard girl. Or you can follow me on Twitter, Tumblr, or Instagram at graveyard girl. Same way it's spelled here. I love you guys so, so much, and I will see y'all tomorrow.